Well, that was a close one, huh? They shot up my goddamn plane, mate. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. I suppose it's a start. Do you think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother just to weed people out? To protect himself. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? Just think about this. Thomas, too, was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. What if they pooled and hid all their treasure together? That would make the guns way all look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so where exactly in Madagascar are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know. <laughs> what are you laughing about? The people who survived the caves. The recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. <sighs> There's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. What do you mean? Well, you know, the news, there's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah, it, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but, you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So are you going to start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're going to need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket then? Oh, uh, you know, you don't have to do that. It's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. I'm, I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you too. What are the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. The map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. And one of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. We see some ruins up ahead. Now 
Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest for by. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go! Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. Tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. But oh, oh, see? shit. Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe, uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Go check out that tower. I'll come with. Got some big plans for this winch. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. There. That ought to do it. Whoa, whoa. Wow, that looked like a problem. Steeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> oh, poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor. Patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all. Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! Sam. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight to them. 
Oh, shit. You do have the drop on. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Okay, I think that's it. God. Damn it, Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. <laughs> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than rape? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Saying the same damn thing. If they found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam, you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. Pretty much it. 
Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the war... Uh, Check it out, boys. What is it? Hey guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. What do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. You don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Huh. Shoreline must have been here before. Find his keepers. Sounds good. All right, I'll see if there's something up here. Hey, guys! There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Sam! Special delivery! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, kid, you all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I've seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. Are you two just relax? I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? Keep up the good work, kid. Before more shoreline show up. Hey. Now, let's get that bridge down. There we go. Tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? <laughs> Sorry! Bump! You know, not to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? <laughs> Let me know when I can open my eyes. Gonna take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, 
path. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the guns way heist. <laughs> Which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partner how much a job is really worth. I wasn't exactly <laughs> expecting to be partners with him. Guys, we're gonna find it, pay off that lunatic, and still have plenty to spare. Trust me. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. Uh-oh. share on this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. The whole thing under control. Hold on to something. Oh. Huh. Well, that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost disappointed. Uh, almost. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. Huh. Looks like there's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Breaked over. All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. Uh, heads up! Oh, Jesus! I said heads up! He's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. You guys, coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas, we meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery, Thomas too, and that's uh. Um... That's Adam Baldridge. That's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh, let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe, maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys, <coughs> whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this.
trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's gotta be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Fire in the hole! Get down! We got the drop on them! Oh, shit! It's an ambush! Drop them down! Run, you shot! Let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. Sam? Yeah, yeah over here. <clears throat> hey, what are you doing? He's confirming a suspicion. Shh. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. Crap. Uh, but still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that no, one. No, 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 no. No, Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Uh, Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. Uh, if you run into any of those shoreline clouds, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. But we've seen crazy before. That we have. Ooh, watch it. Hey, watch it.
Hey, here we go. Locked. I guess we're gonna have to sneak in. Discreetly. Implied by the use of the word sneak. So. Hey, Sully. I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. <laughs> Jesus. Long way down. <sighs> You okay back there? You keep your pace. I'll keep mine. Yeah, well, at least you got a great view, right? <clears throat> okay, let's see what yeah. we got. <clears throat> it's right in the middle of the city. This is a very tall clock tower. Yes. Yes, it is. Hmm. Now, what do you bet? They don't have the best coverage in this city. Well, no reason to wait. I'll be right back. Okay. Oh, boy. I'll be damned. And check it out, Sully. The clock still works. Yeah, I noticed. And try not to get tangled in those gears up there. You bet. Two down, two to go, kid. Uh, 
Let's see here. There you are. Sure hope you're doing okay out there, Sam. Go, 
Jesus Christ. Hey, Sally. Oh, shit. At least I got the door open, though, huh? All right. Hey, look. The coin. You want it? Yeah, sure. Why not? See what's down here. Fingers crossed for piles of gold and jewels. Sam, finally, you okay? Just search my towel. I, I got nothing. Yeah? No. We're definitely in the right place. Make your way over here. Are you serious? Uh, okay, I'm on my way. He's coming. Good. Sully. Way ahead of you. Whoa. Hey, are those our boys? Yep. Henry Avery. Founders. Founders of what? Worst scavenger hunt ever? <laughs> there are Avery and two sigils. These are a little different, though. Yeah. They got those star patterns on them. They turn, but which way are they? Whoa. Okay. Should we go look? Yeah, d just a second. More pirate symbols. Adam Baldridge, Anne Bonnie, and uh, Christopher Condent. I mean, there's, there's too many permutations. I say we see where that door leads. Still hoping for some treasure, yeah? You and me both. Hey, look, I was right. Baldridge, Bonnie, and Condit. Splendid. But why are they here in the first place? Well, let's find out. Oh, that mustache. So look at these stars. They're just like the ones on the Avery and Two sigils in the other room. Yeah, hey, you're right. Ah, uh, that's right. Content went by Billy One Hand. Here's another one of those star patterns. Yeah, but this one's different than that first one. Oh, yeah. Good catch. Thank you. What do you think? Those Avery and Two sigils. The stars on those lined up, remember? I bet these line up, too. Hmm. They are, uh... You don't know, do you? Hey, there were a lot of pirates out there, you know? So we're stuck? No, we're not stuck. Would you... Give me your phone. What, you're gonna phone a friend? Close. Text a brother. There. You know, these are actually some nice paintings. If we don't find the treasure, maybe we could sell them to a museum. Let's find those star patterns. Okay, just saying. Hey, you still in the tower? Yeah, I just uh, climbed back down. What's with the picture you just sent? I'll fill you in later. For now, just tell me who's who. Well, the, the dolphins are Richard Want, the trident is Joseph Farrell, and the two hands with the pearl is William Mays. All right, great. Just stay where there's good reception. I might need your help again. But Nathan, did you find the treasure? No, not yet, but I got a mechanism to solve here. I'll let you know. Books, globe. This Want guy looks like a scholar. Hey, Richard Want. 
He was the captain of the Dolphin. Whew. Looks like he and Baldridge were in a best wig competition. Hey, Sully, give me a hand. You got it. Thanks. <sighs> Straight? Who the hell cares? Well, I care. There. God, look at Farrell's face. Looks like he'd rather be anywhere else. Honestly shocked you don't know this stuff. No, I, I do. I just want to make sure Sam knows. You know, because he likes to feel useful, that's all. Aha, uh -huh. of course. Shit. What happened here? A uh, torch probably fell or something. Come on, let's see what's left. I don't recognize this guy. Looks a lot younger than the other pirates. Oh, Sam texted me back. Now, see there, Sully? Turns out Sam doesn't know everything either. Huh. No name. This guy's get-up looks Moorish. Huh. Yazid al-Basra. Looks Indian. Close. Muggle. Wait, aren't the muggles the ones Avery robbed? Honor among thieves. <laughs> yeah, like that's ever the case. Not sure yet. Maybe send it to Sam? Really? Hey, you're the one who said he's the pirate expert. Just hey, that's saying. one. And two. Last one. All right, let's see what he makes of them. You know, that kind of looks. Huh. What are you doing? You just took pictures. Hold that. You know, Avery's recruits wouldn't have had smartphones, obviously. Obviously. So this would have been the only way for them to get to the next clue. <laughs> These are clues. Yeah, let me see. Voila. <laughs> oh, all right. These... Could be trade winds, yeah, and these look like latitudes, yeah. and I would guess that we are packing our bags again, Boyle. What? Prodeus quod licentia. Oh, no, it can't be. Can't be what? Oh, my God, it's so obvious. Nate. Why didn't I see this before? Jesus, enough of the beautiful mind shit. What the hell are you talking just, just, about? Hang on. Sam, did you get the photos? calling what I thought was Sullivan's phone, and look who picks up. How you been, Nate? Hey, Rafe. It's been a long time. How did you get this number? Sullivan leave it on a cocktail napkin? <laughs> I wish. That only would have cost me a few shots of rum, right? No, no, I had to pay top dollar to find you guys. Yeah. I hope you didn't spend too much on this whole Avery thing. I hear the competition's fierce. Yeah, you pulled off some clever moves there. But in the end, all that matters is who gets to Avery's treasure first. <laughs> oh, that sounds like a bet. Hey, Nate, you know I'm always game, but my partner, well, she prefers to mitigate unnecessary risks. Wow, Rafe Adler, taking orders from somebody else. Oh, how times have changed. Look, Nate, I'm gonna make you a one-time offer here. You drop everything. Go home, live your life. I'm willing to forgive and forget, for old time's sake. 
As tempting as that sounds, Rafe. I gotta say, I'm not normally the kind of guy who likes to quit while he's ahead. Okay. Rodeus quote will set you. Forgotten liberty. These are nice pictures, Nate. Good composition. You hacked our phones. You stole my cross. Listen, Nate. If you're half as smart as you think you are, you'll accept my offer. What's it gonna be? Listen, as nice as it's been to catch up with you, I really gotta take this call, so... Well, Nate, one more thing. Nate! What? You, uh, you do realize that your phones are equipped with GPS, right? I'll see you soon, buddy. Shit. Let me guess. Goons with guns on their way here now. Sam, for God and liberty. Nathan, do you understand what this means? Sam, listen to me. Get off the streets right now and destroy your phone. What's going on? Rafe knows where we are. We gotta find some place to hide. Sam? Sam! Damn it. Hey, I'll buy you a new one. Sam's Tower. It's definitely Sam's Tower. Come on. This way. Pardon me. Excuse me. Excuse me what? How long you think before Rafe gets here? <laughs> Let's not stick around to find out.
Hey, Nate. Yeah? We can never, ever come back to this ship. Add it to the list. Ah. Whoa, 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 watch it! Really? You got a 4x4, four four. go around. Hang on! Sorry, fellas. First time driver here. Wait a second. Let's see that truck get past that. Oh, come on! Come right! Come right! Wait, wait! Don't worry, I got this. Got this, I got this! I don't got this! Oh, shit. We're close. Keep an eye out for Sam. Hey, I think that's him. Right there. Hold on! What do you think I've been doing? How do we get to him? Damn the Barno. Keep following that convoy. Man, you think they sent enough goons after us? Well, we're still alive, so maybe not. Ah! <laughs> 
Alright, brother! Get closer! Try! Okay, okay! Hop, Hop on. on! Sam, get in the goddamn car! I'm faster! Stop arguing! Watch out! Oh, shit. <laughs> No Fleming way could have survived that. Why chance it? Damn it. That's not good. Holy shit, he's still alive! I think the coast is clear. Yeah. All right. Prodeus Cor Licentia. This looks like a simple cipher. Forgotten liberty. I mean, it's their damn motto. All the paradise references. I can't believe we missed it. See you two made it out okay. Way better than okay. We found Libertalia. <laughs> Liber... Liber what are you? Libertalia. Seems Avery founded the legendary pirate colony. Uh, it's more of a pirate utopia, really. Okay, but what about the treasure? See, as the story goes, this place provided a safe haven for hundreds, maybe even thousands of pirates, and they, they shared everything. Property, resources... Money? And they kept it all in one common treasury building. Okay. So, where is this... Kami Pirate Sanctuary. Right here. That island, just northeast of King's Bay. Hey, hey, hey. Rafe has a copy of this. Yeah, well, by the time Rafe figures it out, we'll be well on our way to Libertalia. I'm telling you, that treasure is as good as ours. <laughs> Shit. How's the Malaysia job going, Nate? Seems like you're a hair off course. Elaine, it's... It's not what it looks like. Really? Because what it looks like is that you're searching for Henry Avery's buried treasure. And given the shoreline soldiers that are all over town, I'd bet you're not the only ones looking for it. All right, well, I... 
I guess it's kind of what it looks like. But, but I can explain. Look, it's gonna sound crazy. Try me. Well, for starters, um... This is, uh, Sam. Sam Drake. My brother. Hi. I'm sorry. I, I thought he had died in a Panamanian Neat. jail. But I was obviously very wrong. He's been stuck in there for 15 years, and it's because of me. And the guy who broke him out wants a lot of money, and the only way we can pay off the debt is Avery's treasure. But, but that's the good news. We, we found it. it it's, it's on an island just off the coast. Okay, just stop. Was there ever a Malaysia job? I... Okay. Come, on, come on, wait. Elena, wait! I don't get you. Look, I, I wanted to tell you. You know what? Enough! No, I wanted to, but how could I? I don't know. Just say it. I had to protect you. That is bullshit, Nate. You just didn't have the nerve to face me again. I, I knew you would react like this. How would you react? You lied to me. For weeks. If you were killed, I... I wouldn't have even known about it. And now you have a brother. Who are you? Oh, come on. I'm me. Come on, it's me. It's different this time. Oh my God. I have to save him. I don't even care about the treasure. The look on your face when you walked into this room. If you're done lying to me, then you should stop lying to yourself. I got a plane to catch. You do what you have to do. Hey. Hey, what are you doing? Go after her. We're not done here. Well, maybe we should be. What are you saying? I'm saying maybe there's a smarter way to save Sam. Such as? Such as we give him a new identity. We, we put him in hiding somewhere. He's I got been contact. in prison for 15 years. He's not going into hiding. OK, fine. You go after your wife. Sam and I will head off for Libertalia. Without me? Come on, you'll get both of you killed. <laughs> really? <laughs> Kid, I've been doing this for a hell of a long time. I think I might be able to handle. Hey, you want to be helpful, Sullivan? Go keep an eye on her. Whatever you say. Got it. Let's go pack your bags. <laughs> 